Today was a very exciting day. We signed a, a committed business agreement and a long-term relationship agreement with AMP, a specialty vehicle conversion company based in Cincinnati uh, that will make use of our electric motors in a uh, commercially available, fully equipped, uh, ready for people today, all electric vehicle, uh, really fulfilling the promise that we've talked about for so long with electric and hybrid vehicles. America loves our crossovers, their SUVs, so we thought let's do the first crossover, the first large EV. AMP's located in Cincinnati. We uh, started three or four years ago, like everybody else, we were uh, trying to build our own motors. But then when we found out that, that Remy was making motors for hybrids and that they were proven and had millions of miles on them, um, and that all the costs have been leveraged out of them. If you're a company like AMP that wants to buy a motor rather than make your own motor, uh, Remy is the largest in the world. We've got 100,000 unit capacity. Nobody else has that. We've got um, not only unique technology in our patented HVH um, uh, stator, but it's, it's well proven. We've got 80,000 motors on the road. We've got a billion miles of proven reliability. AMP's an ideal partner on many fronts, primarily. The, uh, the fact that they are offering an all-electric vehicle today that is fully drivable, meets all of the federal safety standards, uh, has all the features and, and options that a consumer would want, and a mother could actually put a soccer team in her car and take them to soccer practice and come back again with that vehicle. They need electric motors, we make electric motors. How's that? What that means to Madison County here is it means First and foremost in the, in the initial phase, phase one, is primarily skilled technical resources that are required in the engineering, design, testing, and initial builds of those products. Those tend to be smaller numbers than when you get into mass production that follow on later on. Uh, but we see this, this being able to triple our job count in, in, in our Anderson operation, uh, probably taking us something close to 300 people uh, building motors there uh, on a daily basis on just what's under that grant. And if the market is truly successful and has the, uh, shows the kind of potential that we believe it can, uh, that can be much bigger than that.